Hi everyone, I'm Gail, and I'm back with another video haul, um, where it's like more of a collective haul, um, and I was inspired to do this video because the other morning I woke up and there was snow, uh, not a whole lot, this is our second snow for the year, well, first for the year, and we had one back in um, November of 2019. So, just a few items that I have to show you how I keep warm here in Northeast Ohio, and I'm going to start out. Uh, with the first piece, this long cardigan, I bought at uh, Walmart back in November, and it has the Walmart tag, yeah, size large, and uh, just nice, warm, I think it's made of acrylic, and I paid $23 for this, $22.86. But I thought it was cute. I like the color of it. Um, so that's it. It has pockets on it. Next I have is a strip of coat. I've had this for a few years. And this is by um, Newport News. And it's just the midi length corduroy coat. It has a little buckle on the uh, cuff of it. Just a cute coat. I like the color. And then next, I looked at this a couple of years back. And this is, uh, it's like the lure of Everett. And this is, um, by some a brand called Cativa, made in the USA. It's just uh, velvet with all these beautiful polka dots. It's like a swing coat. It has the pockets on it, and the sleeves are just a little bit longer than three quarter lengths. But just a really cute coat. Next. This I've had probably about five years. Time to get rid of it. It's a Worthington leopard print. Um, it comes down to about my knee. And next, another thrifted coat. And this one's by Alona. It's a vintage coat. Next is another thrifted coat, and this one's by Loriva. It's vintage as well. Just the block, color block coat. All thrifted. This coat I paid a dollar for, but I had to pay sixteen dollars to have it dry clean. But it was worth it. Next, this was thrifted, just your cape. And this is um, Marona from Target. However, it was thrifted. It comes with the faux fur, which can be detached. And next is another thrifted cape. This is a vintage cape. Uh, this collar, it can be removed. Someone sewed it on. There's no tag in it as far as um, the designer or the size. It just has a tag to say dry plane only. It's oversized, but cute. And lastly, this coat was thrifted as well. I call this bear, such a big coat. Um, there are no tags in this one. This a vintage coat. This one I paid up for it. It was $15. And I had to pay $15 to have a dry clean. 
And this is more of a maxi. But, uh, just a really cute coat. And I will come back and style all these items for you.
Thanks everybody for checking out my channel. Um, I hope you were inspired by some of the items and they were all thrifted at one point or another. Um, and my coats I get during the uh, off seasons. So I picked them up for a dollar or two, maybe three dollars max. But the most expensive one that I paid was $14.99, which was the long brown one. And then it cost me another $15 to get clean. So that was like $30, which wasn't bad for to pay $30 for a coat of that um, um, status, the, the, the fabric and uh, the substantialness of the, of, of the coat itself. Um, then the other ones were all a dollar or two, so it didn't cost me that much to have those dry cleaned. And like I said, these I've had three or four years, or maybe five. Um, but anyhow, if you stuck it out this long, I'm hoping that you will go down and subscribe to my channel and uh, hit the bell uh, to be reminded when I post again and uh, share to your friends and family and uh, what else that's about it but please do hit the subscribe button and thanks again I'll come back and I hope that you were encouraged like I said by some of those items go to your local thrift store Goodwill Salvation Armies um, your Catholic charities, they have a uh, church that sponsors sales a lot of times. You can find things there. And uh, save your money to go on vacation or buy something that you need uh, as opposed to spending a whole lot on retail clothing. Um, so, see you again. Bye.